Hello guys and welcome back to Happy Freak Friends. I'm Chris X and I welcome you back to Stargy Valley. This time it's been a long long time that I haven't made video uh, from gameplay and I had some uh, no actually much progress. So I'm gonna show you exactly what I did all this time because we heading to the fourth year. It's already winter. It's day is Christmas, the Christmas day in the game. I prepared already all the rooms as I wanted. I think uh, the house starts to look more like house than what I had before. And of course I in, <coughs> and of course uh, my farm is also progressed. Uh, you will see actually exactly what I did, but here is my favorite. Since I had much iridium, uh, I made this house full of crystallariums so let me just give me a moment to gather all of the diamonds I have to do things faster because today is Christmas and they have to go to the event so let's drop all these diamonds 74 diamonds in one go and an amethyst I just had an amethyst uh, crystallarium because I would did to have 10 hearts with Abigail because I'm gonna propose her tomorrow and also, I read about Krobus that you had to need to, to have good relationship in order to unlock uh, the mission with the talisman. I don't know anything yet, I haven't seen the mission, I'm gonna see it next. So let's uh, head to, first of all to our animals, our adorable animals. Let me collect all this stuff, all these eggs. Yeah, I do have also to void chicken. And let's head uh, to the left, to the barn, where my big animals are. Uh oh, the feast uh, already started of the winter star, actually it's the Christmas. Uh, the Halloween is exactly the same type of event, they don't say it's a Halloween, but everybody understands what it is. It. So I brought uh, this fried mushroom uh, plate with me. Because in this event, in this year's Christmas, I have to give a present to George. And I've read in Stargy Wiki that this is his favorite present. Where is she going? I thought she will also participate in the event. It's Christmas after all. So we're back here. For the third time, I'm in our Christmas event. So my favorite Abigail, tomorrow I'm going to propose you. Yeah, you don't even know, you don't have a clue, but you will see tomorrow. So where is our... Ah, here he is. George. i give uh, the present now. Yeah, that's it, the fried mushroom. For him it's something special, I don't know. Oh, so it's you! Ah, fried mushroom, thanks. What? I thought you liked it, Ben. Alright, so who is my... Oh, it's Caroline. The mother of Abigail. What is this? Come on, reveal your present. Hi, Chris. I'm your secret gift giver. Here, open it. Okay, let's go. Is a tea set. Oh, that's nice. Probably decorative. It's not much. Well, okay. Uh, I think I liked it. So, the event actually is nothing special. It doesn't even have a shop, if I remember. I'm not going to speak to anyone. I'm gonna leave, because tomorrow is the big day. And also, uh, we uh, already uh, have completed all of the bundles. And the last bundle actually is partially completed. We need a large milk or a large goat milk. So it's the last piece and I have it right here. So we're going to finish with the bottles tomorrow. I don't know if everything is gonna happen tomorrow, but I want to check my new set, my new tea set. Is it decorative? Yeah, where can I... Oh, I'm gonna put it over here. Oh, shit. Let's see how it looks. Mm, not bad. I just want to change this decorative here because it's not visible and leave that. Yeah, much more like it. 
And all these, those are the three statues that I unlocked. Uh, if you see my other video, I'm going to put a link on the description. And tomorrow is going to be the big day. Let me find this pendant. Here it is. The mermaid's pendant that you buy from this strange person uh, appearing only on rainy days at the beach. So good night for today. This night we're going to reach the million with all these diamonds I sold. And yes, I was correct. We do have a million after all. That's fantastic. So we're heading back out. We're going to pet a little bit our animals. And when the time comes, I'm going to propose to Abigail. We already have three candles over here. So it means soon I'm going to have the fourth candle. I don't know when, but I think it's going to be uh, it's going to be very close. So I have to five how many silos i don't even remember i built all this area in order to leave the animals in the spring summer and fall to get out and eat grass all this area i think is fantastic let me collect also those oak reasons so it's time to go to find our future wife exactly on time 9 a.m heading in Hi, hi to you as well. I want your daughter. I'm gonna ask for him and I'm gonna ask her to marry me. Let's do this. What? I accept. <laughs> I accept. That was easy. What? I'll set everything up. We'll have the ceremony three days. Oh, she's gonna set up everything. I thought the band had to set up everything. But she accepted. In three days we're getting married. In the first of the spring. No, on the first of the first. <laughs> on the first of the fourth year. So let's going to complete also the bundle then. Since the ceremony is going to be in three days from now. We have much time in order to complete also the bundle. I have the large, the last actually element I need to complete the bundle. Let's get inside here. So, proudly I present you the last product I need in order to complete all the bundles. Let's do it. The last bundle complete, I'm gonna take the reward of course. Oh, another cheese press. Have many. And what's next? Of course, I think the Junibos now they're going to disappear. The last bundle. Farewell, Chris. Ooh, a cutscene. I did it. I hope the Junibos are happy now and the wizard as well. You don't know orthography? <laughs> <laughs> goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye, Junimus. Do I have a present for that? Nope. What am I supposed to do next? I filled all the bundles. What's what's next? Now what what's going to happen with the community center? I thought it would be much more surprising cat scene. Probably it's going to be in the future. But the most important is that we will have our greenhouse and soon we're going to visit uh, the desert because we have this last mission here I already gave all these secret things I don't know stuff that mysterious key I uh, want wanted me to give him and now I have to give the sand dragon his final meal actually I didn't know what it what would be the last meal of him oh it's Friday I forgot about this. But I don't think she's necessary anymore. I used her in order to collect most of the bundle stuff, like the truffle. Because I haven't found a truffle yet. So let's collect some hardwood. Actually those slimes cannot hard me anymore. Because I have this ch uh, slime charmer ring that prevents damage from them. And also I finally created the iridium band, which is the best 
uh, ring, actually it's not ring, the best jewel ring that you can have on your wrist. And uh, I made all my uh, tools iridium. They have much, much iridium because of those that trick I made last time with the staircases. It's also a video that is gonna be that it's in the channel. If you like to check it, it's gonna be on a link below. So that special thing that uh, the dragon in Calico Desert needs for final meal is just a solar essence. That's according to the Stargy Wiki. And I'm gonna check it right away. So we're heading to Caligo Desert then. That's odd. Here is everything is snowy, iced, and in Caligo Desert that's a few kilometers away. I don't even know how many, but not too far. Everything's gonna be different. Yeah, that's the obscure thing of the game. So let's go to the Dargan. Uh, yeah, it's... what? Yeah, even in death, it yearns for its taste. So this taste... You place the essence in the dragon's maw. Only then, do you notice a note hidden, of course. You've proven yourself, kid. Check out the pile of lumber next to your house. Mr. Key. So let's head back to the... I just want to check if the usher... Actually, it's not an usher, it's a... Uh, I don't know what, how can I call him? How it's called here? Bouncer? Doesn't speak. At all. And this is Sandy. What are you selling? So you're selling honey. I do, I think I do have honey. I think I have wild honey. I'm gonna take one piece. Just in case, if there's something different. Uh, Starf, okay, all the others I do have them. At home. So I'm heading back. I'm not going to visit the Skull Cavern. I'm just gonna collect all these coconuts. Oh, I have some fair maple syrup. I didn't notice when I was living. My loyal horse just lost me for a couple of hours, maybe less. And he is missing me. That's very nice from him. It's so sweet. We finished with that. Oh, I didn't check. Forgot. But I have to check the lumber pile. Let's go back out. And let's check... Oh, yes. It is the card. The casino card. It's a club card, actually. You're not sure what it's for, but it seems important. It's been added to your wallet. Okay, so tomorrow... We're gonna visit the casino, since the, ma the wedding is go not gonna be until the first of the spring. So let's have a nice night's sleep. From four o'clock. Oh, the Junimas. One last visit in our area. In our world. That's fantastic. Of course I'm sleeping with my eyes open. Because I'm sleeping already approximately... <laughs> I don't know how many hours, really. More than 12, about 14 hours. So, let's head back out of course i have to check oh what is this uh i okay that's great a fried eel i thought he would give me the spicy eel anyway i have good uh, relationship with mono of most of the villagers but it doesn't matter actually because the most important are abigail and krabus so let's check our new oh looks beautiful it looks beautiful. Let's get inside. That's a, a really uh, big building. It doesn't look like that from outside. Can I take this decoration? Nope. What am I supposed to do with this? Should I put water? Nope. Everything is just decoration? I guess so. So, I'm gonna use it in the future, but let's uh, head to our animals. I want to visit them. I already missed them. We're going to leave from the Stargy Valley once more. And we're going to visit the casino. Actually, the oasis. Which eventually gonna be a casino. And we're back in the Calico Desert. 
which actually is a very small place. I thought the beginning is gonna be larger, uh, because it looked like, but uh, it it ain't. It ain't. So we have to show this card probably to the bouncer. Oh, yeah, it is a club card. That's right. Now step aside. Blo <laughs> yep. Oh, you may enter. Oh, where did you go? Okay, doesn't matter. Oh, that's it. That's that definitely. Oh, wh who is you? Ah, uh, you are Mr. Key. It's good to finally meet you. Welcome to my exclusive clubhouse. You've got the spark. That's why I singled you out. What spark? Oh, the conduit of mystery, of art. What about what are you talking about? People like us have a responsibility to keep the world alive. To give folks a taste of the extraordinary. You say Kate that word's like a bowl of rice? What? It's got substance, but it ain't worth nothing without a good zest sauce. That's where we come in. Didn't you ever wonder who put treasure chests in the old mine? What? Ah, the, the treasure chest. I like to give people surprises, so you did it. You'll understand someday. Just keep doing your best and never give up. It looks scary from here. So, what am I supposed to do in here? Can I play? Wanna play Calico Jack? Uh, do I have any coins? Hey, the betting fix, uh, it's for 100 coins. You don't have enough. How can I come? How can I uh, take some coins? I don't know. I have a statue of endless fortune for sale. Only one million. My god, no way. What? What is the statue? No, I'm, I'm gonna pass for now. Well, we, it's not my lucky day. I drank too much. What what, what, about, what are they talking about? What? Ah, here it is. Probably. Yep, that's it. No. That's decoration. How can I buy those... I don't know, what do you use? These uh, coins, weird coins. Oh, the rare crow, the last one. The last rare crow. Yeah, I would like to, but how? I don't understand. How do I collect these things? The big table. I need a thousand. Are you kidding me? Where am I supposed to go? Ah, oh, am I stupid or what? So 100 coins is just 1,000. Oh, that's nothing. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna buy a bunch of them. Right, I spent approximately 100,000 Gs just for the casino. I don't even want to know what the reaction of Abigail will be when she will understand that I use all our money in order to gamble. So I'm gonna take... Uh, they have so many nice, beautiful stuff here. Uh, I already have this actually, the burned of offering from the, uh, from the museum. But I'm gonna give the 10,000 uh, for this rare crow. It's the last one, so it's a need. And I still have six more... Uh, 600 more, so I'm gonna play on this table over here. Or can I can I try this one? How does it work? Oh, I see. Uh, I see. So I will bet uh, 10. How does this change? Uh, maybe the combinations? Oh, okay. Let's try more. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I took plus 20. Okay, let's bet 100 this time. Nope. Oh, whoa, what did I do? No, no, no. Come on, give it. Nah, shit. All right, forget it. I never, I was never lucky in slot machines. So I'm gonna play this. What is it? Poker? Am I supposed to come from here? Oh, it's blackjack, calico jack. So this is the 100 coin table. All right, let's play. Oh, it's just a typical one. What? Two? Okay, of course. How how do you play? Like a normal blackjack? S eight. Alright, I guess we're going for 21. Nine. Twelve. Sixteen. Twenty-three. Okay. It's, it is actually, but it doesn't have ace. Twelve. Okay, hit another one. Oh shit, thirteen. Twenty-two. Disqualify. Another one. 
Okay, 11. So this is gonna be 21 with a 10, but it doesn't have 10 actually. Okay, I'm gonna stand just to see what happens. 17. Oh, I see. That's how you win. Double or nothing. 9. 10. That would be great for a 9 now. Ah, shit. Again, an another 7. Okay, it's 10. Okay. That's cheating. That's totally, totally cheating. Uh, I guess I'm gonna leave from the casino. Am I supposed to come back for something or we already finished? Uh, I don't know. We already finished with Mr. Key. So anyways, I think I'm gonna wait also. I'm waiting for a ceremony uh, after bundle completion. Let's get back with 100,000 G's minus. Yeah, actually Abigail is gonna be mad. So my horse uh, was wondering where I am. What am I supposed to do to today? Uh, do I have something more? Uh, but actually it's not even necessary. So let's see. The Abigail, Abigail, I don't know, she still says girlfriend here. I don't know if I'm supposed to give her a present tomorrow. Let's put this last statue, uh, crow, scarecrow. And let's head back in our house, in our cozy, beautiful house. Look at it. I already have also the room for the kids, where are they gonna be? So, we'll g I'm gonna leave this day to here. I don't know, I'm not going to continue anymore. I bought also this, so I can have unlimited wallpapers as well as flooring. That's why I picked all these colors. I'm not sure about this one. I don't like it so much, the flooring. Anyway, we're gonna see tomorrow what's gonna be. So, we're back on the last day of the winter. I do have a message. Oh, it's Rosmodius. He just gave us a present. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna use it very, very wisely. I'm gonna sell it. And we do have... Oh, yes, this is the scene, the cat scene. Actually, it's happening. We finished with the uh, bundles. And the ceremony is taking place on the last day of winter. Yeah, finally we completed. Uh, that's what we needed actually in order to progress the game. The completion scene, the ceremony. And our mayor, of course. Over here, that finds everything ready in his uh, village. He doesn't do anything about his people. But of course everybody votes for him. Like in real life, we always vote for the stupids. Yes, and I'm here with my cowboy cat, the hat. <laughs> I'm not sure how you did it, Chris, but the community center has never looked better. Yeah, with you, Mayor, of course not. You've done Pelican Town a great service. Everyone in town is pleased. Do I g get any present for what I did? As a way of saying thank you, I'd like to present you with this town's greatest honor, the Stardew Hero Award. That's fine. Ooh, a trophy. You received the Stardew Hero trophy. Who is coming? Yeah, what's that? Morris? Oh, sales have been plummeting. Where have all my customers gone? Oh, so it's the judge's owner. He looks scary. He looks like Dracula. Yeah, yes, Morris. All my customers. Yeah, you're actually all the villagers, you mean. This isn't good. Yeah, relax. How does it feel? Let's be reasonable. Let's settle this old-fashioned way. No, no, no. Let's be reasonable. It's of no consequence. I'll just run a 75% off sale. And all my customers got crawling back to me. Begging for forgiveness. You'll see. Get out of here, Morris. You failed. Not this time. Gather around, everyone. Actually, the the result 
I thought it would be more surprising, but actually not. I remember when I first moved to Pelican Town, this building was active and vibrant. We worked together to make the town a better place. There was a real sense of community. George, you always used to the... Ah, uh, now he will start speaking to all the citizens? Anyway, to do the crossword puzzle while sipping coffee in the community kitchen, remember? The good old days. Emily, you you wove the custom banner for uh, for the Stargy Valley Fair. I remember you working on that for years. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, actually everyone is gonna answer to him now. Remember when your little crab experiment got out of hand? <laughs> yeah, that I do. We showed one morning at the place was crawling with them. Alright, I guess that I'm not gonna keep all of this stuff. You see everyone? Our community is what makes Pelican Town special. When George and Mark came to town, we lost sight of that. But now thanks to Chris, we have a second chance. I'm asking that you join me in boycott ah he wants to make boycottage i see that was my result of my effort to make boycottage to a big company who's with me obviously i am because i did everything for that result i've lived here too long to see this town go to ruin you can't count on me No more Joja, everyone is against Joja company. I'm done. He left crawling. He left running. Morris and his Joja Mark cronies were never heard from again. So that's how it happens. They closed their big successful company just because I brought products to those Junimas. I forgot what I had. Oh, this is the trophy. So the most prestigious award of Stargy Valley. That's great. I'm gonna decorate it in my house. Let's give the present this pumpkin to Krobus. It's an amazing gift for people. It's a great honor to receive something like that. Who are your people? You never explain. Anyway, do you unlock this this stupid door actually I want to get inside when this is gonna be available I don't understand what am I supposed to do so I'm gonna we visit the wizard and uh, I'm gonna prepare for tomorrow that my wedding is scheduled where is my horse did I come with my horse or I lost him where are you dolly oh my horse is here all right so let's uh, go to wizard can I join you do you have a cutscene for me? Do you have anything to say? Uh, okay, you pervert. I'm gonna go to sleep. Yes, from 11 a.m. What's wrong about that? Because I want to see tomorrow the wedding. Ah, uh, it starts like this. So, the ceremony. I cannot see me. What do I wear? Tuxedo? When Chris first arrived in Pelican Town, no one knew if he'd fit uh, in with our community. But from this day forward, Chris is going to be as much a part of this town as any of us. It is my great honor on this day, first of spring, to unite Chris and Abigail in the bonds of marriage. Ooh. Can I kiss the bride with the purple hair? Well, let's get right to it. So it's a political wedding after all. Chris Abigail. As the mayor of Pelican Town and regional bearer of the matrimon matrimonial seal, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss. <laughs> oh, we did. I kissed her on her hair. <laughs> Only Marnie is happy. Everyone else <laughs> don't even care. <laughs> I don't understand how this works. Life is going to be different from now on. Uh-oh. But the future looks bright. Okay, that's what you say 
to husbands, always. Okay, I want to see what will change. Uh, actually, what changed? I don't know, I have a message. Pierre's general story is now open. Ah, uh, yes, of course, he's the father of my wife. Of course, he's going to be available for me. <laughs> Alright, let's see everything. Oh my god. Oh my god. I need to use... So what happened? Oh, she's here. My wife. My wife is here. Do you have any big plans for the new year? Mm, actually, I thought we would make them together. So I'm going to give her a present. She's... Oh, what? What? A new room. What's that? I don't understand. What's that supposed to mean? She brought her room into my house. Here, take a present for the first day that we will live together. I seriously love this. Only this, not me. Oh, so it works two more hearts now. Uh, I don't know what else am I supposed to do. Oh, I need to take another present to Krobus. Let's not forget about him. A horse radish for our friend from Underworld. So let's go to collect again all diamonds. That's why she married me, I guess. And now I think I have to clean a little bit all this mess. Oh. Ah, the cherry tree. And what is this? Ah, uh, an apricot. That's great, because we have a mission from the first year that Emily wants an apricot. I have to give uh, this apricot to her. But first, I'm going to clean all this mess. Oh, a truffle. Finally, I have a truffle. Can I come in? I need this truffle. The first truffle. That's great. Because I'm going to put this truffle in order to make it oil. Since the mayor asked me, I don't know, a few months ago. That he needs truffle oil. So that's great. We're going to finish all this mission soon. Where are you going, wife? You didn't even tell me that you're gonna leave. So where is Emily? Oh, here is Emily. So you can have your apricot after three years. But it's fresh, at least. This looks delicious. And I have another mission done. Whoa! 600 Gs for an apricot? That means crisis. As a final step, I would like to see the evaluation of the grandpa because the first time he appeared on the dawn of the third year he evaluated me with three candles so after all these i've done with the bundles and the completion and the stargy hero word and everything i would like to see if i'm going to succeed on the fourth candle so for that i'm gonna need to take a diamond and this diamond i need to place it on his shrine so let's go to find his shrine. So, there you go. You place the diamond on Grandpa's shrine. So I think I need to, for him to come back. Look at those beautiful creatures. Look how happy they look. Actually, I forgot to visit Krobus. Now I remembered that I checked on the relationship steps and I need to get to him. But the only good thing with Krobus is that he's always available. He never goes away from the sewers. Krobus means bridge crosser in our language. What the hell is your language? Anyways, I don't care what is your language actually. I just want to unlock this stupid place. This back... Damn it. I don't know how can I unlock it. I guess soon that I have, I'll, I have news. But until then... I believe... Hey, come here. Come here. Take this. That's a stupid gift. Like you. It's just so unfair to have the most beautiful girl with such a character. But I think it's like in real life. Oh, my wife is here. Take another present for being so nice. Did I reach the 12 hearts? Oh, approximately. Can I give her a present every day? I don't know how it works now. What am I supposed to do to become better with her? To make babies, for example. Because I know that you can make babies. So... Uh, we have our truffle oil, that's great. This oil goes directly without even second thought to our mayor. We need to wait until he opens these doors. Come on, open the gates. I have to wait. Wake up, you stupid mayor. 
It's the hero of the city. Yeah, good morning. Uh, did I wake you up? Take your truffle oil. You got the oil? Let me see. It's high quality. Very sleek. Great. Thank you. And my reward is... Except for the bunny, of course. Is that I finished with all the missions. Our journal is empty. So, I don't know what's next. I don't know what missions will be revealed in the future. But I'm gonna leave this video here. Because it's been too long. We finished with the bundles. We got married. We finished the missions. And we're back. On the fourth year, we're waiting for the shrine of the grandpa to appear again in order to evaluate this once more. So, thank you guys very much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like uh, and a comment on the comments below. I'm gonna put on the link uh, and a link on the description those videos that I promised. And until the next video, stay tuned. Thank you very much. So goodbye. Who are you? Oh, a possible future wife.